shooters. Uh, we're trying to find a load today for the Burgers 155.5. I already found, found a load, kind of, but uh, I'm gonna find the uh, higher end. I'm gonna try uh, all the way to 47 grains of N140. My first one sets it's 46.6. Actually, I got some uh, 46.4 already, four of them. I'm gonna use it for cold bore shots. And I got the rifle in a bipod for more stability. I'm gonna sear it right now. I'm gonna put one minute to the left. There's no mirage, this is cloudy. I'm gonna leave it there. Fortunately, I'm shooting low. Good wind call though. So elevation, elevation is 0.34 height, so not bad. I'll write this down. It's pretty windy today, so... So right now I'm gonna shoot the 46.6. I'm gonna clear that. Just gonna take five shots here. I think Chris Lavec is coming. I think it's just us three. That's a lot more recoil. Oh, I should have went up before I took that first shot. Thirty-five. 
That's not good. <laughs> not good elevation. Oh, that's not bad. Point six four elevation. Should be good enough for this video. I'll make another one, a continuation of this part right here. I'll link it together though. So this is the second part of my reloading checking. And I got the 46.8 Berger 155.5. Let's see how it does. 46.6 didn't do well. So it might be 47. So I forgot to turn on my target camera. So I'll speed this up. I do turn it on after I take the five group shots so you 44. get to see what it looked like. We all make mistakes, especially me. I make lots of mistakes. Sorry about that. Oh! Forgot to turn on the other camera. Oh well. You can kind of see the group there. Here's a seventh shot. Doesn't look too bad. Um, 47 is pretty fast. It's going 24, 70 some. And it's really flattening out the parameter, so it's a bit hot. Alright guys, if you like this video, like, share and subscribe. Thanks for watching.